We'll return with more after this. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. To throw on second down, Miles. He's got Thompson here, complete. And he'll be brought down on the other side of midfield at the 43. Well, I mean, look, obviously there's no 20 or 30 point play in that playbook, but they can try to end things here on a positive note despite trailing big, and that looks like what they're trying to do here by pushing the ball downfield. Well, let me go with the heavy cliche then, partner. Just control what you can control right now, and all they can control here is how their final plays develop. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. Back to throw. Miles over the middle complete. It's Hall. And he'll be marked down right at the 20 yard line. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. Pressure applied, and he's going to be taken down. They sack him back at the 33 yard line. Miles Garrett able to disrupt yet another pass play. That is his third sack of the afternoon. Looking to throw on second down. Miles. This pass out wide to Hall. And he'll be hauled down at about the 30-yard line. Ninth play of the drive now on third and a country mile. Looking to throw. Miles. side it's complete and he's brought down but not before he reaches the eight yard line back to throw miles and he's gonna be dropped back in the 15 yard line Daniil Hunter coming in for that outside linebacker spot and he buries him for a loss of seven Here's a give to Hall. And they get to him quickly here as he stopped right around the 13. Only a couple yards there, and that's going to set up a long third and goal. Looking to throw. Miles. Throw left side, hauled in by McBride. So no gain on the play. And that's going to bring up a fourth down. As expected, their goal team yard town. And the Jets get a small measure of revenge as they cut into this fourth quarter deficit. Extra points safely through. And that trims the lead a bit, but still standing at 26 points. The Jets kick team out now to boot this one away. Fielded just outside the goal line. And it's a pretty good return here as he'll get this up to the 29. The Minnesota offense about ready to get this next drive underway. Well, they don't really need the points here, Charles, given what we're looking at on the scoreboard, but they've scored on three consecutive possessions, three consecutive drives, and I'm sure that they would like to keep that streak going here and continuing to pour it on. And things have gotten that way in the NFL, haven't they, partner? Because in the old days, people would, you know, they'd get off the gas a little bit, right? But now, people continue to accelerate. But we'll see what they decide to do as they come out for this one. But the way that this game has gone, they've got to be awfully happy with their execution overall. The CD, they're up big, but they're still passing it. I mean, this is an offense that's had a lot of success in this game, and it seems like they're just having fun out there. And it does feel like there's been a shift out there, doesn't it, partner? Listen, if you're up, you can continue to do what you want to do. It's up to the other team to make you change how you do things. They'll continue to throw it around until stopped. The Vikings send out their punter. Always a good sign when your first punt comes in the fourth quarter. Forty-seven yards on the punt that time, just one yard on the return. And the Jets will take over first and ten. Another drive coming up for New York's offense. 
Where we stand right now in the fourth quarter, this one pretty much out of reach. And Charles, I know they're going to be disappointed about several things with this ball game, but the self-inflicted wounds, they've had several turnovers. You'd have to think that's going to be something they're going to discuss heavily in the film session in the coming days. You're absolutely right about that, partner, because they're going to have to sit in that film room and watch every error that they made and figure out how to not do it in the future. And mentally, I think a lot of the guys are already starting to think about, okay, how do we put this behind us and get better for the next time out? This, they'll use as motivation for the rest of the time that they play to hopefully never be in this type of situation again. So the completion good for six yards, and it'll be second down. You got the big lead defensively, willing to give them that underneath stuff, right? And this is why you work on your tackling. Tackle them after the catch, inbounds, keep the clock running. Just go ahead and bleed the game out that way. Miles. The Vikings after him, and they get there for the sack. They'll wind up losing 10 on the sack, and it'll lead to a third and long. Back to throw. Miles. Open man is Ayu complete. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. From Viking territory now, they'll come up first and 10 at the 49-yard line. Now they'll throw here out of the gun. He's got it complete to Thompson. And he'll go down inside the 45 before going out of bounds. Line of scrimmage, the 43 on second and four. Looking to throw, Miles. And this is gonna turn into another first down as the tackle is made at the Vikings 33. So they'll come up first and 10 now from the 33. Now a handoff up the middle, Hutchins. And the result here, a pickup of eight. Leaves him with two to go on second down. Eight yards the gain on that last run. Here's second and a couple. Back to throw, Miles, it's complete. This is Starks. And they're gonna get this down inside the 20. I think that's a big pickup for a first down because when you run a drag route against zone, you're sometimes asking for trouble because you might run into a defender. Yeah, well there they ran into a first down, executed it to perfection. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. Got his man complete over the middle. That's Thompson. And the Jets are going to be looking at first and goal as they move this down to the four-yard line. Operating from the gun. Miles got his tight end. That's complete. It's Thompson. Touchdown! A great play there. With his second touchdown of the game, number seven on the year. And the Jets get a bit closer. And Charles, they continue to have trouble stopping him as he's into the end zone yet again. Yeah, that's multiple series now that have ended with him in the end zone. A perfect plan on how to utilize him best when they get in close. Extra point right down the middle. And that'll make this a 19-point ball game. A 10-play drive that time. So still lots of work left to do, but here comes the onside kick. And the Vikings able to recover. The hands team does its job. The fourth quarter, they felt like they needed the football back. Unfortunately, they couldn't get it. And I know we brought analytics into the game, and someone has said here that the data says that when a team's expecting an onside kick, 80% of the time, the team expecting it, they do actually recover the ball, which is what we saw here. I just wonder if that number is much more of a anecdotal type of a number. Kind of like when the coaches tell us, well, when you score on special teams, 93% of the time you win the game. I'm still waiting to see that number is empirical. And this winds up a gain of four to the 41. Brandon, I've got to think this offensive line has got some smiles on its faces. And, and I know it sounds crazy, but they practiced for this back in training camp. They knew they'd be in situations where it'd be extra defenders in the box coming after them, trying to keep them from locking down a game. Right now, they want to show the world they're up to the challenge. And they pick up the first down there with a gain of four. Four. 
They'll try and run some clock here as they keep it on the ground. And maybe a measure of revenge there. He's had his way in this one, but this time they get him behind the line. Looking at a second and 11 now after the loss. Well, they've gone to their fullback quite a bit. He'll get it again. Four yards on the pickup there as they get it back to a more manageable third and seven. They don't need to run another play here before the two-minute warning. Let's see if they do it anyway. And again, they'll go right back to their fullback. That he won't quite make it. He needed six. He got about five. Fourth down. It's a gain of five, and now the question, will the offense stay out there on fourth and one? Two minutes left to play in this football game here on EA Sports. So the Vikings in possession of the football as we get you reset. They've got a fourth down here in a game that looks to have been decided already. And his kick is absolutely perfect.